Hey everybody, this is Salandia Hammond, affectionately known as Sue Ham Baby. And uh, yeah, I'm at another restaurant, I'm at IHOP. And I am doing another video for you, the business tip of the day. Now today's question comes from Dala June Herrera. And hopefully I pronounced that name correctly. Dala wanted to know, how do you engage customers and close the deal? Okay, Dala, I am just going to tell you some of my tips that I use, and I have found them to be just phenomenal. Now, uh, because I want to keep these videos between two to three minutes, I won't go so much into detail. You'll probably have to go to my blog post to get more of it. Okay? And I'll leave that blog post at the end of the video. Now, first things first, you have to be authentic, okay? Everybody wants authenticity. Be real. Like right now, I got to tell you, I am upset that I am at IHOP and I am not using their wireless. The wireless is not available on my iPad, okay? But nonetheless, I still wanted to get this video out for you, dollar, dollar, dollar. I'm sorry, my tongue is tied. I'm looking at all the food on everybody else's plate and I'm ready to eat. But I wanted to get this video out to you, Darla, and everyone else who may have this question. But be authentic. People are buying into that. Be you. That's who God created you to be. That, I mean, you can't do you better than anybody else. And no one else can do you. So be authentic, okay? People want that. When you're authentic, people want to know more about you. Which leads me into communication. You've got to communicate with your customers or your perspective of customers okay there's got to be a two-way communication so many times we have a one-way communication uh, and that's why you cannot engage people all right you've got to listen that you have two of these and you've also got to speak okay two of these so do more of this and less of that how about that but anyways open up communication okay ask your customers what they want you know so many times we think we know what they want and uh, we shouldn't assume, we should ask what they want. Involve them. You will be surprised at how you can engage people like that by asking them what they want, what they need, how can you serve them, which leads me into my next point of engaging your customers or potential customers. Add value, be of service, give something good, offer great content. Uh, put something great out there, okay? Nobody wants to see a boring fuddy-duddy or, or a negative Susie all the time. Offer something that's creative. Uh, reinvent, revitalize, re-energize. I'm killing you with the R's. And you'll know what I'm talking about if you watch yesterday's business tip. But, uh, uh, you know, add value, add credibility, add credibility. How do you add credibility? Well, what you do is you build their trust. And you do that through your talents and your gifts and your products that you have to offer. Through your influence and your expertise. Okay? That's how you build your credibility. Get out there. Engage your audience with videos. Engage them with blogs. Engage them with two-way communication. And remember, build relationships. That is the most important thing that is missing from businesses today. Everybody wants to sell, 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 but nobody wants to build relationships, okay? It works, it works. It doesn't matter what platform you're in, whether you're in a selling platform, whether you're in the church, whether you're in a business, wherever. Build relationships, network, and be genuine, be authentic. Now, how do you close the deal? That is the second part of your question, Darla, and somebody else out there that may be watching. Well, give a call to action. That's right. A lot of times you have to nudge people uh, in the direction you want them to go. So for me, like when I put up videos, my call to action is watch this video or, you know, something exciting because nobody wants something boring. You've got to attract them. Okay. Which leads me into attraction marketing. Close the deal with attraction marketing. What is attraction marketing? Basically, it's showing people who you are, what you do, letting them fall in love with you. You know, you're maybe out on a picnic. You, uh, you may be, for me, what I want to do is show people I'm having fun motivating them. So I go to different places and I'm eating or I'm visiting, I'm sightseeing and I'm taking videos and I'm dropping tips. I want to show people what freedom is all about. I want to show people what happiness and joy is all about, what living on purpose is all about. So I do that through my videos and my blogs. And it's called attraction marketing because I'm inviting you into my world and showing you what's going on. Looking at my notes here. Uh, open up to people. You know, they want to know the real you. When you open up to people, they're more prone to close the deal. So give a call to action. Open up to people. Use attraction marketing. Uh, and say, hey, you know, with the call to action, say, hey, get this product now. 
don't kick your butt. Don't kick yourself in the butt for missing this opportunity. Something of that nature. Watch this video. And again, like I said, I'm now over my three, four minute mark. I'm into the five minute mark. I'll go more in detail into my blog post. Uh, again, I want to try to keep these videos short because we know the attention span of people. I want to keep it short, sweet, and informative and inspiring. Uh, listen, you can catch more of what I have to offer simply by going to my website, suham.com, S-U-E-H-A-M.com. Get all the videos, the business tips, success tips, and some of my funny videos because I'm a crazy person. I love to have fun. And uh, you can see a lot of that on my YouTube channel at suham1974. It's all about being authentic, okay? I love to bring comedy and inspiration and motivation into business. And if you don't like that, then you just don't like that because I can only be me. So again, guys, you know, in parting, I always have to tell you to live, love, learn, and laugh. Don't quit. Follow your dreams to success. And remember that I am loving you to life. You guys have a great day. Love you. See you soon. I think it's time for me to do some uh, chin pull-ups. See that extra chin growing back? Yeah, it's time for some chin pull-ups. Hope I made you laugh. So help, baby.